Om Shanti, welcome back and we are going to do the recording of 1st of July Kauli Blessing where Supreme Father says that the truth shall be revealed from your face and also from your behavior. So let's see what are the details about this blessing. Baba says, may you be a great soul who reveals the manners of truth in your face and behavior. So great souls have the power of truth in them. We have to check ourselves when you're listening to this. However, along with truth, you must also have manners. So you can't be sharing truth or you cannot be proving truth with arrogance or with anger or by forcing something onto others. So truth cannot be proved without manners. And that's what God says, everything about great souls who have the manners of truth will automatically reveal their manners. Their speaking, their seeing, their moving, eating and drinking and walking around. If manners are not there, there is no truth. So these are godly statements. That means truth should be revealed through all these things. Speaking, seeing the way they see it or look at others, moving, eating and drinking and walking around. If manners are not there, there is no truth. Truth is never proven by trying to prove it. It is self-evident. When a soul is inside something, thinking and doing something else outside, it can be seen through their fit-getty movements, through their haphazard behaviors and reactions, through their manipulative way of looking and talking and seeing and walking. And God says it is self-evident. No one can hide the sun of truth. So you can try to put a paper in front of the sun but you cannot hide the sun. So if there is truth within you, you don't need to reveal it. It doesn't need to be spoken about. It doesn't need to be shown with your words. It is seen through all these things, speaking, seeing, moving, eating and drinking, walking around. When you don't have truth within you, God says, then you will not see directly into the eyes of that person. You will avoid seeing, looking into the eyes of the person. When you're not true to God, when you're not true to yourself, the truth will never stay with us. So we have to be first true to ourselves, true to Supreme Creator, and then we'll be able to face any situation, any person directly. Facing doesn't mean confronting them. Facing doesn't mean replying back. Facing means that we'll have so much of clean and clear heart that we can, without having any kind of ill feelings, look at the other person, without having to prove anything or hide any weaknesses, Speak to the other person, heart to heart, soul to soul. How do you do this? What is this method? And this method feels so lighter that we don't have to fake ourselves, don't have to pretend to be somebody else, don't have to put a charade of different behaviors in front of others so as to make sure that they don't see through us. And when we have that clean and clear mental behavior, mental thinking through meditation, which we learn in Brahma Kumaris, the truth need not be revealed by speaking, by trying to prove it. You too can become like that, a great soul. Do join the 7-day course at Brahma Kumaris and with this Om Shanti.